Hi guys, Coach Greg here. Today we're gonna play another fun game using something hopefully you guys have in your house. Um, it is a napkin. So here I have my Happy Birthday Hedgehog napkin. I'm very excited to use. Um, if you don't have napkins or maybe you don't use one, you could, for these games you could probably use maybe a paper towel, a Kleenex, um, I don't know, maybe like a small pillowcase or towel or something like that. Um, and you'll see, whatever works best for you guys, okay? I like using napkins, I think they're fun. All right, so, um, playing different games with napkins. So first we'll have to unfold our napkin for all the games. I recommend, if you're gonna wave it around, holding it at the tip for maximum flutter ability. Um, so um, some of the basic games, you know, you can play kind of Simon Says, Follow the Leader type of game. So you have a leader and they can do figure eights, big waves, circles, all right? And you just follow the leader or do Simon Says like that. Um, you know, pretty fun to understand type games. So some other games you guys can play um, if you're looking for something a little more challenging or just want to try new games. Uh, we have, you can do a drawing game. So the only thing is, remember, when you draw, it's going to be opposite. So if you guys are the person playing, I would actually stand my back towards you. All right. So we're going to play. All right. I'm going to do a shape. I'm going to do a, well the shapes you can do facing forward. You can do a shape, you can do a number and a letter. So only the numbers and letters you should do backwards. So I'll do my shape facing forward. So my first shape. All right, I'll try it again. All right, what shape was that? Hopefully it looks like a square. All right, so let's do a number and then we'll do a letter. So for these, I have to face this way, I'll try to do it out the side so you guys can see. So I'm going to do a number first, okay? So my number is going to be, all right, one more. All right, what number did that look like? Hopefully it looked like the number seven. All right, and now let's do a letter. So, in here. Trying not to confuse you with the last part. One more. All right. Hopefully that was like the letter P. All right. So you guys can try. Just remember with numbers and letters, you probably won't have someone looking over your shoulder so they can see, or else it's going to look like a mirror image. All right. So some other things you can play are kind of like how many can you do before it hits the ground. So the way you play that is pretty simple. You pick an activity and you try to do it as many times before the napkin hits the ground. All right, so I'm gonna start, I'll do an example. So I'm gonna do uh, fast feet, all right? So how many fast feet can I do before this is the ground? So I'm gonna throw it up and that's like my go. So ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I got 10. All right, we can do lots of things. We can do nose. Ready, go. One, two, three. Apparently I can't know very fast. Um, and then if you want to do something like really funny, you can do races back and forth. Um, I can't do that because I'm doing a video right now. Uh, we can do spin around. So ready? Let's do it with my left hand. One, two, three. I got three. I'm not too dizzy. So you guys can pick whatever fun activity you can do. Take turns picking what you guys want to do. It can be claps, it can be jumps, whatever you guys can think is fun. All right, and our last game is the pickup game. So what that is, we just let the napkin be free and go on the ground, ideally open it up a little bit more. Work with me, buddy. All right, and then we're just gonna pick it up. So now, easy, you can do, you know, this is the easy one, picking up like this. You can do certain grasps. Um, you can do it with your feet. All right, maybe you can do, you have to get as low as you can to pick it up. All right, um, so you can pick up with a lot of different things. So I'm gonna do elbows. It's gonna be fairly hard and Last time I tried this, I didn't do it that well. So I have to get down. Oh, oh that was actually easy. I did it with my elbows. All right, so you can look for different ways. You can also do kind of one-legged. So if you need help and support, you can hold on to them for support. There we go. And you can do one-legged, all right. Um, but you can come up with different ways to pick it up and then see who can maybe pick up the fastest, the silliest, all right, you can do through the leg reach. All right, so just come up with different ways you can pick up the napkin. All right, if your napkins are a little beat up, that's okay, they're napkins. 
Um, all right, guys. I like to hear what you guys are doing, how you guys are playing the games. I'm sure you guys have a lot of fun ways to play. Um, so let me know what you guys are doing, all right? Hope you enjoy them. Have fun.